The kickoff team on the field now as they will send this one away. This will be taken very short. And not a bad return here. He gets it out to the 25-yard line. The offense now at the line, ready for their next drive. And following the interception, just any interception, are you a little bit more cautious when you start that next drive or no? You just throw that out the window. I think you are. I don't think that there's any way you can run back out there and go, ah, totally didn't affect me. Let's just go ahead and be loose with the football again. You're going to take care of it, but you have to be careful about being too cautious because now you can't run any offense at all. Still want to attack. We'll see how they attack him here. And he takes this from the 30 to the 34. On any running play that's called, they're always hoping that's going to break big and go the distance. But when you get a nice game like that, you're able to do so many things anyway. You can come back and run essentially the same play again, continue to move the ball on the ground, or you can decide to throw the ball now because usually you have the defense back on its heels. And oh, look at that, a diving catch. Defense was thinking run, and they're dealt a pass of just under 20 yards. So on the other side of the field now, it's first and 10 as they've got things rolling on this drive. A run there on first down and a pretty good one of five yards, so make it second and five. Give him five on the carry there, and it'll be second down. On second down, Dickerson. And he'll get it down on the play to the 37. A gain of five, good enough for the first down. Line of scrimmage, the 37 on first and 10. Back to throw, Love. The attempt on the dive, and he has it. What a catch. 17 yards on the play as they try to eat into this 17-point deficit. Luck now, five straight completions here in this second half, first and 10. They'll try the left side, Dickerson. And they'll get to him just inside the 15. Even after the strong run we just saw, they're able to corral him quickly defensively. Brings up second and four at the 14-yard line. Try to get one more in here before the quarter breaks. And that is going to do it for this third quarter of action. You are watching Madden Ultimate Team on EA Sports. On second down and four, Luck. And that gonna be incomplete. A lot of contact, no call, and it's third down. The offense on third down, they've hit two for four thus far. This is third and four. Out of the gun, Luck. And he fires one that's intercepted. Picked off by the 13-time Pro Bowler Ray Lewis. The 40, 30. And he will take this one home. It's a touchdown. And that one will pretty much erase any hopes of a fourth quarter comeback. With emphasis, interception, return for touchdown. Door closed, locked, reinforced. Tucker with the extra point, and the lead is now 24. So they'll get another shot on offense following that pick six, and now the kick is away. The offense back out there at the line, ready for their next drive. And last time, decent field position through the pick six. Obviously costly. But they can't afford to just bunker in now. All right, they, good field position means go ahead and attack on offense. Try and press the advantage a little bit. They just have to be better with the football on this possession. So the last one didn't bother you too much last time. No, because it's, it's exactly what you're supposed to do. You can't have good field position and not try to take advantage of it. Sometimes the defense makes a good play, too. 15 yards on the play, first down. So signs of life in what's been a dormant offense in this second half. Here's first and 10. Now luck. And an alley to run. And that gives.
Gibson now three interceptions in the game. Well, someone's locked into what they're trying to get done in the passing game. When was the last time we had someone get three in a, in a contest? 2011, wasn't it? Kurt Coleman. Oh, yeah, that's then right. with the Eagles. That's right. Then gets it with the Eagles, and I believe it's against Washington and Rex Grossman. That's correct. Call it no gain on the play, and it'll be second down. He has elite instincts from his linebacker spot. He's able to diagnose the run and flies in like a missile to stop that one behind the line of scrimmage. Officially nothing on that last run. They'll try again second and ten. You ain't got nothing. Back, back, go. Slam, slam. Snap. They'll keep it on the ground. Gordon. And down inside the 15, shy of the 10. 12 yards there and a first down. So following the run by Gordon, here's first and 10. Just two minutes remaining here in the fourth quarter of what has been a one-sided affair. So it's our home team here in possession of the football as we come back. And no doubt what they're looking to do is just salt away the final couple of minutes and escape with a win. They'll run on first down. It's Gordon. And for one of the few times here today, this run's not going to go anywhere. Officially no gain on the play, and it's second down. So after the run for no gain, here's second and ten. They'll try the right side this time here with Gordon. He's able to rattle off six on the carry, and that'll get him to third and four. Down. 60 out more. Six kicks. Pull it high. Like screen. Five. Manning now to throw. That's complete. It's Gordon. And they are going to score again. Yet another touchdown as they just add to their totals. And to me, that touchdown allows you to start grinning widely on your sideline. I think they pretty much locked this one away. Yeah, that's the clincher, the proverbial. Oh, and it's a fake. They'll try and throw for it. And this fake extra point attempt failed big time. Not only did they not get it, they went backwards. They've got this big lead. They said, forget one. We want two. Instead, they got zero. Unbelievable that they didn't even attempt it from the 15-yard line. What are they thinking? I do know this. When you fake one in this situation with that type of a lead, especially from the 15-yard line, oh, boy. I, I tell you what, meeting them again somewhere down the line, they'll remember this. Yeah, they'll think that they were trying to clown them a little bit. Chopper! Chopper! Trying to shake off the interception, he'll look to throw. And his pass is intercepted for the fourth time today. Picked off by an American hero, Pat Tillman. And his guys will take over at their own 44-yard line. The offense now at the line, ready for their next drive. And this game comfortably in hand. The scoreboard speaks for itself, but you still got your starting quarterback out there. When, when do you go to the backup, let him get some time? And that's one of the great questions in the NFL, Brandon, because I'm just going to tell you, in the 2015 season, I commentated on three games in a row that were blowouts. And in none of them did the starting quarterback ever come out of the game for the team that had a big lead. And in each instance, I asked the coaches later, on why didn't you do that and they all looked at me and said just don't really do that in the NFL.